Imus in double overtime against Bat Kalookan, Batangkan, Kalu. And as for Imus, they have three wins and four losses, but most importantly, you, the trader is in Payan. One more feed. That's two points for Carlo Lastimosa. And I was about to say that was a no call. I thought Marquis fouled him right there. Pakoor got away with that one that led to the easy two. Jamar on the push. Recovery for Imos. That's two points for Gimpaya. Not the most beautiful fight. I could take. They go to Joe Liu. Inside, Hamito. The fake. Inside. And terrific patience to find Hamito on the short roll. Estrada, what a beautiful floater. Estrada with almost seven minutes gone by in the opening quarter. It's a low scoring ball game. Marvin Hayes scores inside. Or and younger legs. No compara sa Ibos. But at the same time, makalaban mo na pakaraming experience. In life, you talk about a guy that's unfazed. It's really makma. Now, this three point shot is brought to you by Extreme. The one stop shop of life just. This very home court of theirs in double overtime fashion. Defense by Mac Mac. Now Imos is on the fast break. Cardona. Hook shot. Yes. This since he was two years old, even before holding a basketball. For other players, this shot would be tough. For Mac Mac, he can do this in his sleep. Points and a turnover. This is going to be the easiest two points for Mac Mac Cardona, who takes his time. Seven points get ball. And a little casual also with these two points. This Captain Hook Mac. And Coach Christian. Yes, definitely a good sense of accountability for Coach Alex Angeles, especially with this type of rotation. As Alvin Aldai scores inside. Buying time for their starters though to get those extra one or two minutes before they check back in. Good pass by Nermal to Banyete. I have a James Quick today. Almost halfway through the second quarter, Mark Montuano, jump shot, is good! Montuano is a hometown favorite because he is a homegrown, first of all. Right. He's been in this program for the longest time. And last year, he was the most... On to the post, Chito Jaime. We go to Jim Boy. Shot is good! Mosa, terrific job of not forcing the issue was Jaime to Pastoran. But talk about shooting his way into it. Yep. Down to four seconds. Basaran still has it. Step back. Tough shot. Oh, he backs it in. Something changed. Imagine. Basaran. Now a block by Marky on the other Marquee. end. Pekute. Cross over. Pass inside. Good feed to Mark Montuano. Underneath by Pastoran, Marky was right there for support. The other end, the layup for James Quecote, and now Bakoor has the lead. This Bakoor franchise with uh, the youth of James Quecote, and surely the athleticism, the overall scoring ability away from halftime. James Quecote, his three pointer, bombs away. Beautiful design play right here, little decoy. And staggered screen. <laughs> Folks, thank you for joining no, us. No. <laughs> this is Big Scott. Chip Boy Pastoran. Walana Naman. Couple of sorry misses, but where could they ultimately get the football? We talked about the offensive rebounder of an offensive rebound by Quecote. Nice dime by Mac Macardona. Jamar Gimpayan scores against Gimpayan. To Malabas, Jimboy Pastoran, his three-pointer. That's good. And that's a frustration offensive foul right there. Because the team will be able to do that. It's just a one-point ball game. Quecote gets the steal and a breakaway layup for James Quecote. Long way to go, folks. Over 15 minutes. Combining the third and fourth as Pingres recovers and scores. And Mark Pingres obviously picked. Asking for the ISO. He's Pingres. looking to score. There you go. He's looking to score. You could just see it in his eye. But from our angle, this is just classic Pingres. That's what really he, he embodies. Hard work, 
toughness, scrappy. And he never seems to lose his conditioning as two buddies have been together in all of their practices. Cañete inside, he scores. Swinger here for the strikers. And there's Michael Cañete, who is a returning player for Bahor. We missed him here in the MPBL. Remember his back. He drives, hook shot with the tongue out. It's good. 41-38, Cañete. That's a good fake. Inside he goes, and he scores. They tried to swipe it away. Good help by Ludovice, and here's the breakaway layoff for James Cuecote. Fourth quarter now beginning. This is Mix Gomez alongside Coach Christian Nogues against Montuano. Weak side is open. There's Impaya on the hook shot. That's good. Alvin Aldai on the layup. No good. That's a goaltend. Goaltending. Yes, that is Nogues. Uh, bit sa net. 42, James Cuecote on the drive. Lefty layup is good. Yay! How about that? 49-42. Lastimosa, nice. one-hander. That's a nice move. There's such thing as scorers. There's such thing as professional scorers. And Carlo Lastimosa is definitely one as we bring in this episode. How Heruta responds in the last few minutes. 49-44, Lastimosa is looking good. He trim star as well in the MPBL. Pastoran on the spin. That's basket and one. Strong drive to the left. Carlo Lastimosa cutting him off. And this one, great contact. He spins and he kicks it out. Jimboy Pastoran. Yes, sir! by James Cueco there. There's always a turning point play in the game and this could be it if Bakoor can sneak out a win in this one because that block, that previous win of Imus versus Patangas inside, Bakoor goes to Marquis. Marquis! Way back to their champion days. Pastoran, his leaner. The bounce is good. Hey, Mark Bigris inside, he jams it for Imus. 